Yo, Romero, where you been? Uh, I took a couple of days off. Needed a bit of a break from the madness. I think it's good for the mind. Just a <sighs> recenter. Take some time away. Come back nice and fresh. Let's jump into some more vigor. Wonder what's on the agenda with the dailies today. Yeah. Practice makes perfect. Complete five shooting challenges. With a minimum rank of bronze? Too easy. Kill one outlander with a melee weapon. Not so easy. Loot 50 chemicals because I'm feeling the chemistry. That's easy. And place five transmitters in encounters. Broadband. I have been hanging on to those, I think. I hope. If I haven't, then I'm stupid. Let's jump in. Queue up. How are we all doing? Huh? We doing good? Yeah? Hey! That's good. Because, um, the last few days of Vigo, man. If you've been watching, you know. Uh, Sagbrook. What have I got? So I need to place transmitters. So let's whack. Was it say five? I'll take a couple in here. Do I have a jammer? I do. I oh, will take another one. Take a spare. Get to keep it if I don't use it. It's all good. And let's go Saggy Sagbrooken. I wish I'd uh, do my chores. It's been a couple of days. I mean, I should not have fired that butler. Kind of miss him now. Well, for one reason. At least he was here to collect my stuff when I wasn't around. Uh, so all the rat traps are going to be full. Yeah. Hey, Wolfie. Did you miss me, bud? I think he missed me. Coins! They're probably overflowing, which isn't a good thing. I should have logged on and just collected those, at least. But I was uh, spending time... What was I doing yesterday? Oh, yeah, I was going to play this game I got on my PC. In my Steam library called Stalker, that I've never played. For some reason my PC didn't like it. I knew Tarkov has uh, not been playable to me because of my PC, but I thought, you know, this game's built for Windows XP. It's an older game. It should work, right? Scrap metal bits. But uh, my GPU was 80, 90 degrees. Still carrying on. It's one thing that didn't overflow. I thought that something's not right. I'll uh, look at some YouTube videos, see if I can open up my PC. GPU case. I mean, it's an old PC. It's a, it's a GTX 1060. Ha <laughs> ha Yeah, I know. Okay. Alright. My daughter's PC is better than mine. Ha <laughs> No. Mine's old. But, um, opened up the GPU case and the design of that thing, the fan was basically blowing. The GPU has one fan. If you follow my socials, you'll have seen a photo of it. Blowing all the dust into one side of the heat sink and it just totally clogged it up. And no airflow was getting into the heat sink to cool the GPU chip down. I took the heat sink off as well, put some f fresh thermal paste on it. As soon as I did that, just on idle, my PC used to be 49 degrees. Now it's 31. Uh, and running any editing software used to crank it up within five minutes to 80, 90 degrees. Now it sits highest I've seen it go to 50 degrees. And more importantly, that uh, Stalker game now can run at a smooth 50 to 60 degrees instead of 80 to 90. So I might be able to put out some Stalker content and other PC games. Man, like, I know that thing was starting to struggle probably within the last six months. I'm talking about the PC. It was starting to struggle. Before I got my daughter her new PC when she was using it last, I was like, man, this thing's starting to struggle. Now I know why. Long overdue 
dust cleaning. Probably doesn't help that I'll leave the side panel off to try and allow for better airflow because it's a crappy tower that doesn't have good airflow. So Brook. So maybe I have to put the side panel back on and try and keep it cool. I don't know, like I do with my PlayStation with a fan. Like a pedestal fan. God, imagine how much dust is in my PlayStation. Don't even want to think about it. Don't know how to open that bloody thing up. Let's go to Sagbrook. Psycho killer. Yeah, you go, what I'm telling you, man. I'm t like, you can pick them straight away. They all look the same. They tend to be rocking the female skin. Okay. Face paint. Face painted out, out of their minds. And running around with a heavy machine gun. Yeah, these they got two level 50s in here. Two level 50s come into the same lobby. And some poor little green coats that are going to be mincemeat. And I'm smarter than that. I'm going to turn around and head for the nearest exit because I don't need my first run of the day to be food for fools. I think I'm at the bad spawn though. Bottom center. Oh good, one of them got kicked. Little teammate got kicked, bud. What are you going to do? There's no way people have grinded out to level 50 already now, right? They had to have paid for those levels. Oh no, I thought I was over here. This is, oh no. Signal detector is going to get popped before I can even get to that town. It'll probably be the psycho black and white face paint dude. But, uh, screw it. Get some stuff here. I've got to turn my compass and my interactive pins back on. <laughs> I turn them off for the shelter. Reasons. I just think it looks better without them at the shelter. And I always say, oh yeah, I'll turn those back on before I get into a lobby. No, then I forget. Where's this signal detector going to be popped, you reckon? If the psycho was on it, he would have popped it by now. He would have sprinted straight at it with no fear and used it. Or he sprinted up the hill. And he's going to sit there with his... Yeah. He's going to sit there looking at it, ready to shoot whoever uses it. Because they think he's not around. So this is what I'm going to do. Someone mortared it, and then I, and I threw a radiation grenade at it. <laughs> so someone just threw, mortared the uh, loot area. So they're up here somewhere. Damn it, man. They might be the person that spawned down here. I've got to use these before I lose them. Taking shots at someone at the car. Is he shooting at? It's the psycho, right? Where is he though? 
Maybe he got radiated and he's about to die from radiation and he's really upset. Do you reckon? Do you reckon I got him with the radiation because he wanted to try and use a signal detector? Where is this bastard, man? I think it was a green coat. So they're down here looting. Damn it, my only window out is in that direction. I think there's someone up there. That's a uh, decoy. decoy. Hey! Let him have it. It's a little green coat, he wants to do some looting. I think we let him have the loot. Let's go get some uh, loot of our own. I mean, there's more loot. There's enough loot there for everybody, man. But I don't know if the green coat wants to share. Grab the bloody food out of the food thing. <clears throat> no, nothing up here, damn it. Maybe just wait for them to fill their bag and bugger off. There's some dummy caches along the railway tracks. Ready for the airdrop. 
Yeah, I think all those shots I heard start off were uh, decoys. Tell me caches along here somewhere. There's one. You just stopped me because you were rotating your fool. So quiet, I think this got hit. I don't think that got hit. Where's the radiation coming from? Top. Don't like it, man. It's too quiet over that way. under control dude. I hear somebody. What's this? Oh hello. it well okay I think um I go back down there I mean, could be a fake green coat, right? Could be camp and exit. Could be. That's right, we're looting chemicals too. Forgot about that. I forgot! Run Romero! Get to the exit. If the green coat's still hanging around, they deserve to die. Glitched out. Yeah, if you're still hanging around now, you deserve to die. I gave you a chance to grab some loot and leave.
they found a blue box. Yeah, they're definitely gone. This isn't doubly radiated, isn't it? Is it a hope? Cash key? No. Just got to be careful I don't take a double dose of radiation here. out your fool. Stop hanging around so long, get you close to dying. Oh, nice. Some bonus. <laughs> Got out with a pretty good haul. No one had the die. See? No one had the die. I just didn't want anyone popping portable. Uh, I didn't want anyone popping the on-map signal detector. Okay. Because I, I didn't know who might have spawned there. And all the shots, I thought that's got to be a psycho. They just killed a poor little green coat. And now they're going to pop this signal detector. But um, it was just a little green coat. Found a blue box and probably left uh, 10 minutes ago. But I still got a good haul. I missed that little area on the other side of the train there. Not bad. Pop up, yep, yep, cool. See, that's just proof. There's plenty for everyone. There's no need to kill people. There's plenty for everyone. Can we all just get along? <laughs> so I wonder, okay, is this what just happened, right? I spawned in south of the signal detector. She spawned in north of the signal detector, like, um... That little ledge that you have to drop off that you sometimes take fall damage doing before you run into the first couple of buildings there. Right. And uh, right at about the same time, I was throwing the radiation grenade. Pretty much the same time. She was lining up a mortar strike. Both of us trying to get whoever else might have been trying to use the signal detector and ruin our looting. <laughs> it's just, I used a radiation grenade to do it. She used a mortar strike. That's hilarious. <laughs> um, let's go, uh, Myron. Yeah, that's funny, man. <laughs> Alright, let's get some appropriate gear on. Let's change it to a disc of file. Don't really need to rock a badge that says what level I'm up to in the, uh, season. Because people can tell by your level. Because I, oh, I was editing a video where I was singing along. Mario. Builder. Now that's stuck in my head again, man. Extract 25 airdrops. Travel 500 kilometers. Got a builder level 4. Troll hunter. I mean, it does look pretty cool. But it's a bit it's a bit too bright and cheerful and colourful for these outlands. Discophile. Those trolls, man. That was an achievement. Because that bloody flower troll and that pirate troll. They were hard to find, the pirate troll especially. It was driving me nuts for a long time. I mean if I can get a badge for the lighter thingy, man, that's probably gonna be the the greatest achievement. Let's go! I'm just a little builder. Can't 
Come on, Byron. Get us in there. Oh, shelter. Speaking of shelter improvements. Were we speaking of shelter improvements? I don't know. Oh, five shooting challenges, maximum rank of bronze. I can knock that one out after. One outlander with a melee weapon. One. Just gotta get one. I'm not bringing in a weapon. A melee, am I? Damn. It's gonna take a knife. Okay, scrap bin. No, we're saving up metal bits so we can upgrade this. So I can make contact bombs. I need metal parts. Let's do another one. Box of plants? No. Maybe go. I'll have a think. I'll have a think while we're in Myron. What do we want to do to the shelter when we get back, Romero? What should we do? And we should we should scrap this thing down. Okay, scrap it down. So you find another circuit board for a better game. Myron. Look in Myron for why would they have an arcade machine in Myron? Soldiers need something to do in their off time. Circuit board for Centipede, Pac-Man, Space Invaders. Now that'd be good. Find a Space Invaders circuit board. Um, maybe even like a more of a modern arcade machine, like a Ninja Turtles or find something like that out there. Because that Vigor arcade, that was uh, a lot of effort to drag that back here, bud, for nothing. Here we go. Some greenies, some fake greenies. 100% fake green. Um, and we, we, we got a lot of guys coming in with nothing. Like a level 14 coming in with nothing. That's a sacrifice. Uh, level 18 coming in with nothing. Probably another sacrifice. Like especially when they're coming in as green coats. I don't know man. I don't trust it. Don't trust it. I just think, yeah, there's some sacrifices in here for information. For someone to move up leaderboards. Maybe get some sniper kills from a distance. I do like the look of a couple of these fools. Right on the bard safe. Bard house. Someone's going to sprint at it from this direction before you can get that bloody thing open. It's not an all green... Unless the, the scary looking dude spawned up there. I don't know, man. Where's that at? Other side of the map, good. Someone might be trying to snipe across the lake. Why did I throw that over there, you saying? I don't know, man. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why I do anything in this game anymore. There's no rhyme or reason. I thought, you know what, if I can't have it, no one is. I probably could have um, ran over there and opened it up by now. Hundred percent could have ran over there and opened it up by now. 
I think the other psycho dude spawned uh, up top. Probably could have got to it, but I bet you they, they're just sitting on the exit waiting for someone else to open it. That's what's going on. They're exit camping. Well, since we ruined that, what 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 say we uh, actually try and get some stuff before we leave, eh? There's two jammers blocked, so two portables just got popped. Someone could be behind me right now because they came around from this direction. They're probably not going to try and cut across here. They're probably come around behind me. Two to fight a sniper rifle. Someone just over the hill to my left here. Damn, that was my bloody transmitter or something breaking. My jammer, I mean. Oh, did we just troll ourselves? We could have got there and got something, dude. Now you're stuck. <laughs> Let's try and get out of here. I don't know what my brain's thinking in this game anymore. It's fried. Like, even if I w wanted to try and get in there late and grab whatever's in there, it's radiated. <laughs> Anybody trying to get in there is going to die. Maybe. Oh, they could have radiation pills. There they are. They're in there now. Which way are they going to come? This way. They're going to try and go out that way, it's probably being camped. See, I, I tried the old run in, hold square, run back out while the safe is being opened when I've radiated one before, and then took too high a dose trying to run back in when I couldn't loot it. And I ran out and tried to run back in and loot it again. In no grand time. If it had a bloody looted properly the first time, for some reason I held square and nothing happened. I was like, crap, get out of there, you're taking too much radiation. And went back in like, no, try and open it. And uh, yeah. So they opened it on the front side. They're pretty confident. I could have went in there, sprinted there and went in there, I think. No notification pops up and says time safe has been opened, does it? It just says it's being unlocked. Safe is being unlocked, I should say, not time safe. I don't think it says safe has been opened. They're not going to run across here, across this bridge. That'd be suicide. Yeah, they're gone already. They might even be dead because of the radiation, you know.
They're trying to go in that way. Oh, are you serious? Airdrop incoming. Get ready. Have another cache spawn right next to me like that in a bloody long time. If anyone's over here, I'm not going to hear him because of this freaking plane. Hey, no, dude. So good, buddy. Whew, scared the crap out of me. Up. I think he opened the cache. Or he's the one that opened the, the safe. What is he doing? What is this guy doing? I wish I had my grenade. I think he's looking for the cash. Did get the cash. Oh, the green coat had the safe and everything. Oh, I'm sorry, bud. Is this exit being camped and that's why he was hanging around? What are you doing, bud? He was trying to find the cash. Get out when you get the good stuff. Is that a red crate? No, it's a toolbox.
Come on, we can do it. Unfortunately, I've been taking radiation damage for a lot longer than whoever's been over sitting on this exit has been, so... If anyone's still here, I'm screwed. I knew someone was sitting on that exit for the entire time. Entire time. They didn't go and open the barred safe. They were sitting on that exit the entire time waiting for someone to try and leave. That guy went down well too easy. Let's see if it was a headshot. I don't think it was. I kind of feel bad, but at the same time, what are you doing? What are you hanging around for? What are you jumping around, like bouncing around for, man? Go. I, 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 I'm I like, do I push? I think he's trying to get the cash and he can't find it. I didn't think he's the guy that looted the safe. I thought he's just... He, he took a couple of shots at me. He shot first. I'm going to see if he's trying to find this cash and maybe try and scare him off. I took sh a shot. I think he went down like that. So, it wasn't a headshot. What I think happened was he's the one that looted the safe and he took a bunch of radiation damage doing it. I didn't load my gun again, did I? <laughs> I swapped out the... I wanted the Vinteres. So I swapped it out for my AKM and I was probably running around after I uh, picked up his weapons with no loaded gun. I've got to stop doing that, man. I just get in a panic. Dude, what are you doing hanging around? I think he was he was in the middle of opening the cache and I stumbled across him. He threw a flashbang at me and when he should have just shot me. But he threw a flashbang. So I'm like I panic, I see the flashbang icon go down and think it's a uh, radiation grenade or something and I'm like, oh crap. Get away from that. Oh, it's just a flashbang. Okay, I'll give him a couple of waves to let him know. Yeah, okay, dude, settle down. Let's settle down. And then he takes a couple of shots at me in my direction and then starts running back and forth like he's looking for me. So that made me think, you know what? If he's going to look for me and look to kill me, I've, I've got to take back out my... Uh, if I had a grenade, I would have threw it at him. I didn't. I'm going to take out my gun and I'm going to see if I can kill him. And then he must have eventually f dug up the cache or he's in the middle of trying to figure out what he wanted out of it i don't know but then he started running off towards the exit was being camped i think he dies anyway that's what i'm going to tell myself so i don't feel bad i think he was going to run to that exit and get exit camped anyway so at least i got your stuff but the guy you took some shots at instead of the uh exit camper okay i apologize but i thank you I don't think I even listened to the other cassette. I was supposed to do it yesterday or the day before and I forgot. So I might do that now. Uh, reckoning number one. I never even listened to this. Should be able to zoom in. Depression tape. Do not erase. Okay, so this is the first one for reckoning. How did we end last? The last one, uh, Adam was going off to check on the uh, Russian doctor who decided he didn't want part of Ada's plans, 
and Adam was going to check in on him and the uh, female doctor was like no don't hurt him or something so we're going to check uh, Reckoning see if this has anything to do with the same storyline maybe we're checking in on uh, little Freya let's have a look Just as I'm about to record. Ingrid, the girls are up. It's your turn to feed them. I'm about to test this recorder I bought. All right, where were we? Today is April 29th, 1986, and honestly, it feels silly talking to this device as if I'm talking to myself, but I don't know. I guess with all these rumors about nuclear threats and whatnot, I want to document some of the things happening for future generations to listen to. I want my girls to grow up in a safe environment and have a better life than we do. I guess that's the dream of every parent to have their kids grow up in a better world than they did. And I'm worried about what kind of state the world will be for the next generation to grow up in. There has been a nuclear accident in the Soviet Union, and the Soviets have admitted that it happened. One of the atomic reactors at the Chernobyl atomic power plant near the city of Kyiv was damaged, and there is speculation in Moscow that people were injured and may have died. The first reports that something was seriously wrong came from a power plant in Sweden. Workers arriving at their jobs registered abnormally high levels of radiation on their bodies. Although the levels weren't high enough to harm humans, and no accident had occurred at the plant, it was shut down. As tests were conducted, similar puzzling reports of high radiation came in from all over Scandinavia, but still, no accidents were reported, leading to the conclusion that the problem was elsewhere, to the east in the Soviet Union, a fact confirmed to the Soviet people on television tonight. A radioactive cloud headed north across Poland today and into Denmark, where radiation levels were five times higher than normal, to Finland, six times above normal, to Norway, up to 50%, and Sweden, illegally high. Experts tonight say the cloud of radiation is now dissipating over the North Atlantic and poses no further threat to human life, but as the Soviets treat an unknown number of casualties, there's no way to say how much lasting damage that cloud may have already caused. Anjanet Jana, BI News, New York. Jesus Christ. The whole world is going to shit. I gotta make sure they'll be safe in case anything happens. So this is like a fictional universe, a multiverse, a um, alternate timeline, Back to the Future, uh, where the incident that happened in Chernobyl or in Russia um, brought about a nuclear apocalypse this is november 81 on it and the other tapes are dated like in the early 90s where the world has already gone to crap black and back avdv <laughs> is this like a acdc cover band it's got to be right avdv black and back Black and back. Or it's a um audio porn. Chronicles Reckoning number two. We are 
are truly privileged. Tonight, we are eyewitnesses to history. Who on either side of the Berlin Wall or in this country would have believed this morning that this day would end the way it has, end with a very symbol of the division of Europe, of the division of the free world and that which is not free, disappearing or at least becoming irrelevant. That is the result of the stunning surprise decision today by the leaders of communist East Germany, the announcement that East Germans may now leave their country and cross directly into West Germany, even through the Berlin Wall itself. Oh my God, honey, come look. This is huge. They're, they're crossing the Berlin Wall. There you go. Um, these cassettes just all about moments of uh, history, as experienced by this dude and his family. Let's go unload these weapons, and I might do one more. Ah, buddy. Buddy, 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 buddy. Couple of, uh... Oh, he's got that stupid M PAMD gun. Dude. Dude. No wonder he was hesitant to try and shoot anybody. Maybe he tried to shoot it. <laughs> he found it. I don't know. You don't want that gun in your friggin' holster, I was going to say, but it's a pretty big gun to have in your holster. You don't want that gun over your shoulder. PAMD. Because you'd be MD mad to carry it. I think it counts as an assault rifle. Worst gun I've ever tried to fire in this game. And three firing modes just just confuses you. So uh, we are going to deconstruct that right now. So I don't ever take it in by accident. Where are you, PAMD? Your P-O-S-H-I-T. Where is it? You're gonna stick it right down the bottom, aren't you? Right down the bottom? Right, right, right down, yeah. Of course. Deconstruct. Get rid of the bloody thing. Okay. I'm gonna drop one of these. Look at this loadout sorted. How many more chemicals do I need? Eight. And place one more transmitter. Do some shooting challenges while I'm loading in would be a good idea. Taking a knife just in case. Maybe, maybe. I mean, that guy there would have been the ultimate perfect person to kill with a knife. <laughs> uh, should have shot at me, not flashbanged me. Let's uh, let's take in a John. Probably die. But uh, we've got a couple of them. It's the one that's going to do the most damage. Maybe I can two hit someone with it. Three hit. I don't know. Unless, unless you're coming up against somebody that doesn't have a weapon or only has a knife themselves, you're not taking anyone down with a knife. Maybe you're taking a smoke grenade to try and get a kill with it that way. Alright, we are going to go Kirsten. Up into the dam. What should I wear? Okay, let's go to Kirsten. Haven't been there in a while. Maybe head inside the dam. Pretty good way to get a kill with a knife if somebody tries to come in down the corridor and they don't know you're already in. You could surprise them, maybe. Anyone with a gun is just going to stand up and whip on you. Throwing a smoke grenade inside the dam could be pretty uh, useful. I don't think the smoke is thick enough, though. I know you've got to be able to see, I suppose, when you run into it. It definitely doesn't last for long enough. I've only tried to use one like once, I think it was, on a shipping container for the seasonal challenge. And going into the smoke, I was like, you know, well, maybe I've got time to open this shipping container right now. Maybe. And then it just started to dissipate on me. I was like, oh, screw that. Let's see how this last one goes. I mean, yeah, I'm going to have to do another one. I've got to at least get 50 chemicals. Eight more chemicals, place this transmitter. 
all shooting challenges. I oh, don't know point now. Three minutes twenty before we're in Kirsten. Before we're in Kirsten. What are you talking about, mate? You've been waiting for three minutes twenty. Scratch that. Jeez. That's not a knife. Look at the size of that bloody thing. Let me in here. I want to have a look at this thing. Dude. You should have wore your Rambo bandana. So not unless, you know, someone comes up on you. Kirsten. And they don't know you're there. So you can get one swing in at least before they turn on you with their gun. Um, and then maybe get a lucky second hit on them. If they don't go down after two hits. You're dead. I think you're dead anyway. Alright, we're leaving. I see a familiar name and I don't like it. So I'm leaving. Mr. Wear a green coat. This guy is a tool, so we're out. Don't want to be in this lobby. Uh, there's some dodgy looking dudes in here, man. Mr. Uh, Camps at Exits. Hopefully I'll spawn near one so I can just turn around and leave and we'll jump into a different Kirsten if there's enough time on the clock. If not, we'll head somewhere else. What was the, what was the name of the other map that was up? There was another one I was thinking of going to instead of this one. But not hanging around in this lobby. Suspect behaviour, people, and don't want to be a part of it. For me on an exit, come on, please. And I'm nowhere near an exit. What a surprise! Okay, then, um, which one would be the safest to run to? Probably this one. bloody interactive hints and everything turned off again and my compass yeah because anyone here is going to be sprinting to that um, and there's too many spawn spots up here that I don't like the look of but we need to get around there quietly There is nothing more that I'd love that I'd love to do than stick this uh, knife in that vampiro guy's throat. But with my ping, I'm not beating uh, psychopaths, so we're leaving. this so that at least gets that one done. Damn the disruptors right there that could attract attention. This is just a mission to get out of Kirsten. That's all the mission is now. jammed a nearby Outlander, so there's someone around me. So 
that's probably them there. They might be in range trying to use the uh, jammer. Someone could be just camping this. I should have went north. But then the time safe is there. Someone will be camping that too. And we do have a known camper in here. Is that that Bampiro guy? Could be. I forgot he's dressed as a green coat. It is, look. It is. Hell yeah. Dude, you deserve that. I wish I had tried the knife in now. I said I'd love nothing more than to stick this knife in his throat. I, I should have thrown down the smoke grenade and then he would have like been confused, run around behind him and just tried to knife him. I, I picked it, I say, is that that Vampiro guy? He rotate. he was rotating around to kill the likes of me. But it's weird that he, that, but that's what I did, he did last time I come across him. Last time I came across him, he did the same thing. He didn't. He heard me in the building, in Deverg, I think it was. Didn't go inside the building. Instead, he ran past the building, ran to the exit, and uh, camped it. So I'm not exit camping, dude. Sorry. little green coat. He's going to run to the other exit. Let him go. So he hit the um, safe. He hit the loot container. Let him have it. I didn't know I was that close to the exit. Sorry, bud. I was here having a conversation with uh, myself. Sorry, buddy. Could have got a knife kill. Could have smoke grenade him and got a knife kill. I wasn't exit camping, I apologize. I got caught up in a story. <laughs> Let's get out. Don't want to uh, kill a tool and become one. Let's leave. Yeah, what was I saying? He, he ran past the exit. Uh, building I was in went to the exit as the radiation cloud was rolling in and sat there if you've seen it you'll remember sat there just past the tank that was on the road waiting for me to get there staying just outside of the countdown waiting 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 and then I was almost dead because the radiation took shots at me as I was trying to get out and killed me um so I think that's what he was trying to do there. He was thinking... Maybe he recognised my name. I don't know. He knows the way I like to play. 
But it's just, yeah, he was... He was rotating around like me. Saw me and hid sort of like me, so I thought, oh, it's a green coat. He's just trying to loot. He's trying to get past me. So I gave him a couple of waves and ran on by. Tried to give him a wide berth. But then he turns and starts running after me. And then stops listening for my footsteps. <laughs> and I wasn't going to give him the chance to uh, kill me again. I got revenge. But I should have threw a smoke grenade. I should have threw a smoke grenade down and tried to kill him with a knife. It would have been so sweet if he was the one that I got that done with. <laughs> Damn it! All I could think of was he doesn't know I'm here. I could kill this idiot right now. I guarantee you, I know who it is. There's the daily done. The daily double! We're not holding triangle on that because I don't want to claim my seasonal yet. I'm going to go in here and do it this way. Claim. Still need chemicals, so I have to jump into another one. He just ran along like he wanted to see where I went and then stopped. Like, he could have kept rotating, and then he decided he wanted to chase me. Um, yeah, Fisk was the one I was thinking I should go there. So I might do that. What do you have, an M4A1? Is that the new seasonal gun? I don't know. Dude took in a ton of bandages. Did he have a daily for bandages or something? I didn't find those myself, did I? And disinfectants and painkillers. Dude was stocked up on Healy's. He was looking to get in fights. Okay. I'm going to take his little M4A1 for a spin. Thanks for the gift, bud. See each other down the road again, maybe. Maybe next time you'll come out on top. But today was my day. I just wish I'd have used my knife on you. So chemicals is what I need. Let's go Fisk. See if I can get some. This thing doesn't have a scope on it, does it? I don't think I've ever fired this gun. Maybe I have. Ooh. Yeah, I have. It's not bad. He's not running around with this to play. I reckon his plans were to rotate around to the northern end and uh, camp that exit for whoever was trying to get out with a time safe. Or he was looking for me. I don't know. Because he had the perfect spawn if he was going to exit camp, right? You saw the guy that hit the loot container was trying to leave that direction. If that was him, I don't know. What range has this got? Not bad. Probably hit a shot even without. No. Nah. Bit hard to see the dude. Let's get the little dot on that plate up there. There it goes. Good rate of fire, though, man. How many of these do I have? M4A1 assault rifle. Got two other ones besides this one. Ton of ammo for it. I like it. Thanks, Vampiro. I'll uh, try it out. I like your recommendation. Head to Fisk. Maybe I'll have a chance to use it on someone else who deserves it. 
Yeah, I don't trust that he was like, oh, look, it's a friendly dude. Let's just go up the road with the friendly dude and maybe we can be friendly loot buddies. I, I know that guy. I think he was like, oh, look, the guy waved and he doesn't want to fight. And he's, he's, he doesn't have any weapons drawn. Let's chase after him and shoot him in the back. That's what he was going to do. All green, cross the board. Close. Oh, jeez, man. Mate dog. Buddy. You're one of those? You're one of those running around with a mesha wanger wanger? Farming kills? Which one of these is your uh, spectator cam, bud? Which one? This guy? Ash935? Kevin Ho? Which one? Which one's your uh, farm kills spectator cam? Buddy. Buckfink? My money's on Buckfink. There's a little spawn down along the water's edge here. Maybe I'd go through this area. I know there's another spawn around here somewhere else, though. Probably, uh... Spawned here with that guy. I'm betting. The rain's gonna make it harder for him to see me, though, so... nothing in here. Great building to lay the bloody thing down in. There's nothing here. Damn it. Should have put the alarm trap up on the hill in case anyone pushed past it. I would like to go down there, but not yet. I don't like that being in here, it's going to attract attention. We've got a lot of gunfire up the hill, but I think it's all up on that stuff. I'd say someone's already gone through the tunnel. I'm 
weird spot for a boat. boat at the back door. <laughs> so there's more spawns along here, people are looting. Um, the tunnel does, but the entrance to it is there. Can I get out this window without falling in any water? I can. So cool. Brilliant job on the weather effects. Give me a red crate, I haven't seen one in ages. Chemicals, I forgot we are doing that. Another open door. Stand up, you idiot. I should go back through the tunnel. I don't think they went that way. Somebody else probably came up through there. I know there's a red crate that spawns in there. Sometimes. Jeez, man. Really? They used the jammer. Maybe they panicked because they thought I was coming after them.
Where did they go to use that? I swear they're just here somewhere. action is happening along this edge here you know what I mean like why there's nothing here the loot containers up here time safe is some bloody where else why are we all here fighting along here another mortar Two mortars. What are you doing, dude? What, are you, what? What's so precious to you right now? chemicals we needed I'm gonna die to radiation because of these fools crap I don't have any fuel do I nope Getting stuck near this freaking exit on this map what am I doing here oh, there's the time safe there why so much action right here so weird You're going to die to radiation, but... I didn't realise it was that bloody close. On the dumbest exit in the game. That's including... You know, other maps. Let's get some map XP at least. Okay, if no one opens this, I'm screwed. this road again. Mm. 
Oh yeah, yeah, put the fuel down here. Ah, uh, well. Just stand here by the road. Adios, muchachos. That's slowed down by someone with... Act them weird. Act them real weird. Run over to my spot. Looking for me. Throw down a jammer. Like they used a portable. Sprinted over there to try and find me. Couldn't find me. Then they laid down a jammer. Then maybe they used a portable to make sure there was no one around. Because they didn't feel safe. And they pinged me instead of the dude that was chasing them. But then they mortared the building next to me twice. That, it, that goes in the books as one of the weirdest encounters I've ever played. And it's going to be the last for today. We got the uh, chemicals we needed. So let's get out of here. Yeah, like how anyone in that part of the map is supposed to get out alive is bloody ridiculous. Unlock that freaking exit. Okay, why, that one being locked makes that whole north eastern side of the map a real pain in the ass. Because if you you go over there to try and loot anything, someone will just camp the southeastern exit for the entire time, so you can't get out, and there's not enough fuel around to be able to get out. I've never found any fuel along the northern shoreline there in those buildings that I was going through and someone else was going through. Maybe they had all the fuel in their pocket, but I've been there on my own many times. Never found any fuel. The only fuel you find is way down the road towards the southern exit. And usually that's all gobbled up by whoever wants to camp that southeastern exit. That northeastern side of the map is the dumbest exit on any map including battery drog it's absolutely stupid to have that exit there locked i've probably seen someone open it once in maybe 30 times of being there something like that i've seen someone open it once have I opened it myself ever? Nope. Nope. Because you can never get any fuel to do it. It's a dumb exit and they need to fix it. But they won't. Alright. Put your hand down. How far along are we in the Hunters? Getting up there, getting up there. What's the next thing we're getting? The John plan. That'd be handy to be able to craft those knives. And then we'll go for those coinage. Daily claim. Let's go do some shooting range challenges. If you want to hang around for that, I don't know. <laughs> um, and that'll be it for the day. What do we got? Bronze. We only need bronze. Might as well use a uh, M4A1 that I was just using there. It's quite a nice gun. Not that I got to use it in the raid. Because it was one of those games where. Oh, you, you, oh. Hey, I only gotta get bronze. Okay then. <laughs> it's one of those raids where you hear a lot of shooting and carrying on, and people are uh, using mortar strikes, and you hear the loot container gun, pew, 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 and you hear this one safe being unlocked. Jeez, it's awesome for all the audio cues. Alright, alright. If it wasn't for all the audio cues in this game, sometimes you wouldn't hear any, you wouldn't uh, have any action. It's one of those maps where you just, it's a quiet one for a change, but there's still a lot going on if you know what I'm saying. Jeez, what have I got to do to get hired in bronze? I need like, I don't know, have 10 energy drinks and... Uh, Put my uh, aim assist on. Whack a Cronus in. Have it lock onto these uh, 
Scarecrows. Oh, we don't need to be doing that one again anyway. Oh, jeez, man. Look at this crap. I press my trigger and nothing happened. Alright, we're not going for bronze on this one. So these shooting challenges with the machine guns and stuff are, are really good. Yeah, alright. No more machine gun uh, bronze challenges, please. Exit out of there. Let's use a different gun. I can't even get a bronze challenge with a machine gun. I need a mouse and keyboard or something. Like, I'm not a mouse and keyboard player, but it'd be so much easier to line these shots up with a mouse. I'm trying to use a thumbstick. Trying to use a thumbstick to lock onto people is insane. There's, there is no... Did they... They said they changed the aim assist. I think maybe my aim assist is off. Hey, let me check something. They said they changed the aim assist. Get out of there. Get out of there. They uh, reworked the aim assist to be less obtrusive or something. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. But, um... Options, controls, aim button, hold, advanced controls, aim assist is on. I mean, you do need some kind of aim assist with shooters on controller. You do. Because... Trying to use a thumbstick to aim is so unnatural. It's harder to point and shoot. you got to like rotate across with your thumbstick. It's not easy. Unless you've been playing these games since you fell out of your mother's womb. Then it's probably really easy for you. more stamina man you know what screw you scarecrow No way, man, I hit that first shot, I swear. One more, thankfully. <laughs> just one. Just one more. Please, just one more. One more. I think they've got to be head checks. Oh, yeah. I, I don't know, my... It seems too, um... My sensitivity seems too high for when, you, like, the, it ramps up too much when you want to go to the next guy. You've, you, it either goes really slow and you move the thumbstick just a little bit more and it goes and ramps up too quick. And I know you can change all those settings, but I don't know what I'm bloody doing with that stuff, man. I don't know about uh, curve and all that sort of stuff. Like, all this crap. Get your sensitivity, and then you've got, oh look, aim Y ramp up, aim X ramp up. Maybe my aim X ramp up is too high. It sort of ramps up too much when I'm trying to strafe, like go across. I think maybe I'll turn that down to at least two and see what it feels like. I think they've got the aim Y ramp up by default lowish, so that you, if you're trying to go for head shots, it doesn't ramp up too much when you push up on the thumbstick, but I find even going left to right is too fast. The aim acceleration delay. Maybe I need to put some kind of 
delay on the aim acceleration so that when I try and strafe across it doesn't accelerate straight away which I seem it seems like that's what it's doing aim acceleration time seconds after which to begin applying extra speed at maximum aim stick tilt while aiming you might as well be speaking Chinese to me I don't know what you're freaking talking about okay sure let's put more of a delay on it so you don't ramp it up on me so quick see if that makes a difference in a dead zone out of dead zone aim exponent zoom exponent like give me a break man why can't I just point my gun and shoot it and have it be the same settings as everyone else is that too much to ask <sighs> anyway <sighs> that's gonna be it for today it's a good day of vigoring we had some success early we ran into a toolie and got revenge it's pretty sweet. He was going to try and shoot me in the back. Guaranteed. He deserved what was coming to him. I just wish it was my knife that did it. I'll see you in the next one.